Hi, it's Kim Switnicki, your sex coach, and you can go to yoursexcoach.com if you're seeing this in some place that's not on my website or in an email from me. I'm going to give you uh, five Valentine's Day gifts that you can give yourself. I'm going to give you these five brilliant ideas in honor of Valentine's Day. And I'm also, because it's Valentine's Day, I'm also going to, if you stay tuned, give you a coupon for 25% off your order if you order by midnight on Valentine's Day 2011, which is what it is now. So Monday night at midnight, if you order, you can get 25% off if you wait to hear the code. Don't forget to join us on the call Tuesday, the 15th of February in the evening for my call with Rabbi Ed. He's going to be talking about, he's a cancer survivor, prostate cancer survivor, and he's going to be talking about how to get your sexual mojo back. He's doing a wonderful presentation online and both on the phone, and you're going to learn a lot of stuff. You're going to have so many tips and ideas and things to do. If you or someone that you love has been suffering from cancer, whether it's prostate cancer or breast cancer, um, those things that can really affect your intimate relationship. And he's got wonderful information for you, so do check that out. It's free. Um, also, the West Coast Women's Show, for you local ladies, please bring your men on down this time. It's in March, March 5th and 6th, I think, and I'm giving a, a talk again on the Sunday. And it's actually a workshop. It's really interactive, so bring your men on down, ladies. This is going to really help you be able to get on the same page as your lover. This is, is a really fabulous workshop. Worked really well in Calgary and Edmonton. I think you're going to really enjoy it. Um, I've been doing a number of interviews. I'm going to be trying to get those up on the blog so you can hear them and read them. And there is a new erotic story. I believe it's under your stories on the uh, menu. And there's uh, you can always check it out on the blog, too, under erotic stories. Okay, you ready for the Valentine's Day gifts you can give yourself? The first one. Dig out from a back drawer or a cupboard lingerie that you perhaps haven't worn for a while or go buy something new. Go buy a lovely piece of lingerie for yourself. Maybe your sweetie's going to buy it for you or some sexy PJs and make sure that you wear them every night for 30 days. So wear them for a month. You're going to go to bed wearing something really sexy and sensual that just makes you feel more feminine and like a woman. So please try that any time of year, any time, any time. But Valentine's Day, give yourself a reason to do it. Um, the second thing is, wear some sexy underclothes. Ladies, you can wear, you know, even a garter, a sexy bra, fancy colored panties, you can wear fishnets, you can wear whatever's going to turn you on to be wearing it, and then just notice how differently your day is and how differently people interact with you, because you will be acting differently. And men, you can do the same, maybe not necessarily with the garter and the stockies, but you never know. Whatever works for you. Number three. Notice your erotic energy. And when we talked about this in my Unlock Your Sexual Code program that I do online, the ladies were really enjoying this concept. And this isn't about noticing when you're turned on. It's about noticing erotic energy. Buddhist monks use their erotic energy, which is your chi, your life force, and they just bring it up and use it that way. So I'm just suggesting that you notice that you have erotic energy moving through your body. And notice the things that actually get that erotic energy moving and buzzing a little. Could be a color, could be something you hear, could be a song, could be just some really lovely body part that you go, oh, okay, there's just that, that bit of movement. It's not being turned on, but it's just that erotic energy flowing. If you want to know more about that, give me a call. Um, notice number four. Notice how much TV you watch in a month. And if you're watching like four hours a month, likely it's a lot, lot more than that. Consider cutting back on a few of those hours because sometimes I know it's really good to unwind in front of the two. But can't you unwind as well if you're naked? Uh, hopefully you can, whether you're alone or with a partner. And just consider trading off some of that TV time with some naked time. You don't have to have sex, but just some naked time. And number five, as always, the 10-second kiss. If you're single, you can either plant a 10-second kiss on somebody that you know or maybe don't know that well and want to get to know more, or you can give somebody a hug, somebody you really love, whether it's your child, whether it's your friend, um, whether it's a parent. Just give them a really good, solid, present hug. And if you do have a lover, then please give them a 10-second kiss like you really, really mean it. Okay, the coupon code, for those of you that have hung out to the very end to get your five tips, the coupon code is V, as in Victor, V25. 
If you enter that coupon code V25 when you place your online order, and you can go to kimswitnicky.com, shop for products under the menu, and it brings you to my Lioness for Lovers site, which is where I have all my toys and books and goodies. And you enter that V25 code, and you will get 25% off. So you have to do it by midnight on Monday, the 15th, sorry, the 14th, in 2011, that's where we are now. Um, but it won't be any good the next day. So check that out. Please have an awesome night, an awesome day, a really fabulous Valentine's Day, and enjoy things until I talk to you again. Bye.